This is an Aurora production facility. It's located here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. These builds are crucial in scaling from batch production to mass production, turning years of R&D work into a fleet of autonomous trucks. This process facilitates deeper integration with OEM partners, allowing custom equipment installed today to become factory options in the future. Until then, technicians outfit Class 8 trucks with advanced sensor arrays and computer modules, as well as harnesses and actuators, which allow complete autonomous control. The platform is called the Aurora Driver. The Aurora Driver is Aurora's hardware and software systems that enable these vehicles to operate autonomously, as opposed to having mechanical linkages that would hook you know, an actuation like a foot pedal or a brake pedal mechanically to something else. It's all done by electronics. Gas, brake, steering, those are really the three main, right? I mean, uh, controlling the speed of your truck, the direction in which it's going to go and where it's going to stop. As human drivers, we're constantly processing information about road conditions and then reacting using traditional vehicle controls. The process is basically the same for autonomous vehicles. Sensors collect information, which is processed by the computer making decisions for the Aurora driver. The system then acts on this information by sending electronic signals to the appropriate vehicle controls. The truck is a robot, and a robot doesn't need to sleep and it doesn't get tired. There's LiDAR, there's camera, and there's radar. You've got the ability to see, you've got a point cloud, which is pretty important when you're traveling at highway speeds. Data from these sensors gives the Aurora driver detailed information about its surroundings so that it can operate safely and courteously on the road. It's imperative that these perception systems align to give a clear view of the world. So with the builds complete, these trucks head to calibration. This process aligns the sensors to one another and to the truck. Calibration is important because we want to make sure what the Aurora driver is seeing is actually accurate. When complete, the calibration is validated on a nearby test pad by performing a series of predefined maneuvers. These trucks join an existing pre-launch fleet already pulling commercial hauls on major freight routes in Texas. 